Hi, it's Coach Tony Morgan of the Masterful Engineer program. And today's border, what we're looking at is a Glad Hill Pulsar Coil A Class. The situation is we're being called out to this boiler and they're saying that they're getting no water, it's been blowing fuses every month. We've had a few people out to this unit before us, so we've just arrived and found some shocking news which we're going to show you. The first thing what we found out is when the unit is turned on by these spur switches here, what happens when you turn it on like that, it actually turns it off. So it's wired incorrectly. So the customer's been turning it on thinking it's working, but it goes off. And the other thing we found is the wiring behind the switch is also incorrect, which I'm going to show you. So these Gled Hills need to be wired correctly and by com competent people. I'm just going to show you what's going on here now. So we've got our feed, which we're testing. This is your peak, so our off peak supply. The power's on. Now this switch is supposed to be switched off, but yet you can see 240 volts. So it's not wired correctly because it's not switching off. This is switched off here, but yet we've got power on. You switch a switch the other way. That is switched on. There's no difference. And I'm going to show you why this is like this, which is quite frightening. Now this is the back of the switch, and this is what's happening. These two wires here at the top, when the screwdriver is that's the feed coming into this switch alive and neutral that brown one there is the supply that is the supply neutral but you can see the wide there's another neutral into the same wire and that's not connected this supply is also is not in switching off so when we switch this off on this switch, it doesn't kill the supply to the boiler. So it's definitely wired incorrectly. And this is supposed to be done by an electrician or somebody supposed to be competent at doing this job. And this is how it's been left by someone else. So we're going to put it correct, correct. And then we show the wiring what it's supposed to be like, and you'll see the difference. Now giving it the final test, it's off. Our switch is off. Just show you here. That's off. Now I'm going to turn it on. Lights on. Give it a click. Power's on. You can see there we've changed the switch, put a new switch on because the switch was defective and the wire was incorrect. So it's now working as it should. So that's going to be the end of this video. If you like what you've seen, you can subscribe to our channel, give us a like. If you're an engineer and want to join the Engineer Team Network, just click on the link below. I'll be glad to see you. So that's it from me, and I'll see you on the next video.